What is up everyone? This is Mo Gaming here and today I'm going to show you how to fix the no internet error that you may be getting on your PlayStation 5, the no internet connection available to be exact, specifically on YouTube. So if you're trying to get this error and you like let's say you're trying to watch YouTube, it can happen on consoles as well or like Disney or Hulu etc. But specifically happens more on YouTube. There's a couple of quick fixes that you can do. The first one is you want to just straight up restart your PlayStation 5. You'd be surprised doing that just straight up fixes this issue for you and you should be good to go. The next thing you can do is if you go over to settings and uh, hover over into network and click into settings, set up internet connection. So we're going to do a few things here. Whatever you're connected to, you're going to change the Wi-Fi frequency band from automatic into either 5 gigahertz or 2.4, whichever one ends up working for you. Uh, that's one of the first things you're going to do. So the second thing, before you click into advanced settings, restart your router. So like just unplug it from the back for 30 seconds, plug it back in. You'd be surprised a lot of times this fixes a lot of issues that may be happening. And even resetting your router where the, there's usually a button on the back of your router will end up fixing a lot of issues as well. As well. Just be, be cognizant that this will bring it back to factory default settings, but it will fix a lot of your issues. So once you're kind of done with that, you can click into advanced and you can change your DNS. So once you change your DNS from automatic into manual, you can change it to whatever is best for your region. So where I am, this I use Cloudflare, which is the, <coughs> the primary is 1.1.1.1 and secondary is 1.0.0.1. Uh, or you could do Google's, which is 8.8.8.8 and I believe 8.8.4.4. Uh, so just doing that, you should be good to go. You can press OK, you'll connect to the access point and you should not have these errors persist any longer. So yeah, that's basically it. You should be able to connect to the internet and you should be good to go. If you guys still have any comments, questions, concerns, let me know in the comment section below. More than you guys up. If you guys are all looking to do, please smash that like button on the whole side. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe to that notification bell. All that, more coming out.